you speak a little louder this time? We have a while. I'm not sure I can. You all set? Yes. All right. At 8.46, Commissioner Oswald went down to await the response of the inmates. Uh, they came back and asked for more time. Uh, Commissioner Oswald, uh, after some discussion with them, agreed to extend it to 9 o'clock. Uh, Commissioner Oswald is downstairs now and awaiting the inmates' return, and as soon as we do get a response, uh, word will be gotten out to you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. have no force in there. The prisoners told us yesterday they were inside they would kill everyone if there was a show of force, all the hostages, and they would die themselves. And I am absolutely convinced they mean every word of it. And they will say, also say that they will do nothing to any hostage or in any violent way if the status quo remains. They want to continue to talk. If they go in there, it's going to be a massacre in this prison and it's on the heads of the authorities if it takes place. And I have only but nothing but the greatest of sympathy both for the guards and for the inmates inside. Time can produce something here, but a loss of time and a show of force will produce only death and misery, not only here, but I'm sure we'll have a reaction in black ghettos and other areas throughout the country. What's the purpose of uh, Bobby coming back? Bobby is as concerned as every other black man in this country is. And Bobby is coming back because he feels this. He cannot stay away. That's why he's coming here. Why did he leave? He left because he could not go in and tell the prisoners to compromise their position as the price of getting into this prison. And he could not do that. What will he do now that he's back? Go inside and tell them to compromise? No, he will not. That would be the worst thing in the world for him to do or for the prisoners to expect. He is coming here for his own purposes. You can talk to him when he hits the ground. What time is he expected? He's landing at 845, I understand, in Buffalo. And he will be here, I guess, momentarily. Okay. Have you heard from Oswald this morning at all? No. Hey. We've asked the superintendent and the commissioner and the governor to give time. The prisoners, when I was in yesterday, told us that they would kill everyone and die themselves if force were used. And I'm absolutely convinced they mean every word of it. And if the hostages' lives mean anything, and the lives of these men mean anything, a little time would hurt no one. Well, is Governor Rockefeller going to come here? Will he consider doing that? He, Do you think he should come here? He should come. His refusal to come here is a monstrosity, because what he is saying is, kill these men. I have no concern. All I want to do is restore law and order. And I think that's a, a rotten exchange for lives. Now, tell me this. You what? just said that you do believe that force will be used <coughs> and that madness will prevail. I said that I thought force would be used, that madness would prevail, that the pressures on the commissioner are becoming overwhelming in his terms. I'm only hoping that the one man that could stop all this now, who is the governor of this state, acts before it's too late. There are no black, I have not seen any black guards or black state troopers. Wouldn't that help the situation since most of the inmates are black? Don't you know there are almost no black troopers and there are virtually no black guards in the state prison system? I better go in. Uh, what do you got to say about that? Go!
on the grass. Put your hands off the camera. Yeah, I'm at him. Go ahead. I'm not swinging. I'm taking his hands off. Don't swing. All for naught. What do you feel now? I feel nothing but rage and frustration that a murder would take place, murder of guards and the murder of prisoners, solely because the government of this state would not wait and give time to further negotiations. Four days is not a lifetime, but it may mean a lifetime for all the people inside. What do you think is going to happen? What do you think the reaction to this is going to be? I don't know, but I would expect that there will be a strong reaction in the ghettos of America, There'll be a strong reaction in the Puerto Rican community, the black community, and in the prison communities of this and other states. I think now people understand what force is, how it's used, and that human life means absolutely nothing to those in command of our government. What do you think is happening to the hostages by now? I hope they're not being murdered but my guess would be that they're being murdered. William Kunstler. Uh, it's just, uh, okay. Yes. Yes, okay. Okay. Go down to that end. You see what the... Just stop running around. I want them on the grass. I'll take care of them. Take care of them. Out of the way for your own safety. Stay back. Mm.